Hey, what's going on, people? Might to get a little workout in through my legs today. I know I have cop subscribers on this channel. I know I do. Now, I'm not going to call them out, but I just know based on the way they leave their comments, I know when I have law enforcement on my page, and that's fine. You know, if you like what I got to say, I don't mind you watching. I'm just not going to really tell too much because I just I know you're listening but to all my cop subscribers out there I got a question for you this is just a question because one of my subscribers had an incident with police and being by myself proudly being on my own no family no support and I like it that way because when things go wrong I can't blame nobody but me like you can't be like damn why did I didn't remind me to not fuck with me no more? Because if I didn't fuck with me so much, I wouldn't be $300 in debt. Not that I'm $300 in debt, but I'm, I'm, the point is, you can't blame yourself when you are the one responsible for you. But when there's other people, it's, it's okay to blame others. But somebody was telling me how they had a situation and police were involved. Now, when you, like I said, when you buy yourself, you don't call police on you. Even me, if I have a problem, I know not to call 911. That that should have already been embedded in me. But my question is this. So I was driving on the highway and I noticed that um there was some traffic and the cop state trooper pulled over somebody. And then I see backup coming, like backup, like three cop cars, three um, other state troopers came. I'm assuming because of that, that one car, the cop pulled over. But with a gun, a baton, pepper spray, taser, and all the training that you go through, why do you feel the need to call additional help when you are the one with the gun? You are the one with the taser. You're the one with the baton. You're the one that has authority. But you tend to call additional help. And I don't, I don't understand that at all. It's pretty cowardly to me. It's almost like you can't do it by yourself. And it also falls into when it's black men being stopped by police why do you call additional backup once again when you are the one with the gun the baton the taser etc it's like if you are so scared and frightened why why go through all the trouble of being a badge in the first place just don't be a cop if you're so fucking scared but um that's what I want to know. Why do police call for additional help when they have all of the necessaries, like what I just named, to make it out alive? 